Legend of Total War here with part 46 of my This is Total War Attila Western Roman Empire Let's Play campaign. Previously, um, I don't even remember. I did some stuff. It was only a few hours ago. Anyway, uh, move them over here. All right, so I'm moving these guys back to Syracuse where they can go and recover. They did a good job for me, I guess. Oh, shit. The Burgundians are coming down to Syracuse and it's undefended. And that hasn't fully recovered yet. Oh, I just fucking saw that then. Oh, god damn it. Can they make it to Regium? If these guys can make it to Regium. Shit. Um, okay, so I'll send him to Regium. Don't have to worry about the Gepids now, I think. And we'll hire another navy here. Just temporary, I guess. Let's have a look what we got here. Yeah, you sound alright. We'll grab you. Raise the fleet. Commander. And we're gonna need Merce. Oh, fuck. Well, it's just transports, and it's not even a full stack anyway. Um, all you have to do is kill that guy if they, if they are coming here. I can't believe they've come all this way down here to attack Syracuse, of all places. Well, whatever. That's These guys are hanging around, but they're no threat. They'll disappear in time. Okay. Alright, so how are we going to spend this last eight grand? Um, public order here is very good now. Probably because of military crackdown. Yeah, that's okay. Um, we can spend it all on this. It's kind of a big food consumer, but that would pay for it all. All the food food requirements. But that being said, this region's under control. Let's just leave it grow. Let's have a look where the problems are. So we got Africa is consuming food. That needs to be repaired, yep. What can we do to sort of improve Africa? Well, we can develop more food in Constantina. That won't solve all the public order... Actually, when he sits in the city, that will solve the public order problems. Devastation, immigration is really high. So this is... In a region that's got really high immigration, we should be uh, trying to develop as much money as possible because it's going to really impact on the financially, uh, beneficially, whatever. Okay, um, let's develop that. That'll be good for money. There's an extra three, uh, 700 from culture plus three extra public order. But we need that to support it. And there goes most of my money. If this keeps up, Africa will actually be able to support that army down there. Just on its own. Okay, what else are we doing? Okay, so how are we going here for food? Food's a little bit short at Avaricum, at Aquitania. Um, we could turn... Hang on, how rich is this? It's good. We could we could make a wheat field. Tarakin, okay, we're out of money anyway now. Okay, so any new enemies? Pretty sure I've double-checked this so many times. Yep. Okay. What the fuck? How come they're making so much money from that? Uh, probably because they have, like, no corruption now. Uh, okay, so there's a lot of things that get levels up. Let's go yours. for that and... And that. Good, vastly helping the province there. This guy over here gets a level up. Okay, um... We're probably going to be attacked by the gates, unless we do something about it. Um, you, you might need we an extra troop. Oh, we're out of money. That's okay, don't worry about it. 19 or 20 shouldn't make any difference. Um, melee defense for infantry units. That's for the naval units, so that gives them morale. Naval battle movement speed. That's actually really useful. Okay, what else? I think that's all we can do. Let me have a look at the politics. Okay, we definitely need someone in Master of Soldiers. There you go. We're in the acceptable range, that's... that's okay. Alright, let's move on to the next turn. Okay, so, everything now boils down to killing this guy, which we shouldn't have a problem. If this guy and this guy, they both pick on him, then the rest of them 
Yeah, the rest of these guys shouldn't have a problem taking them down. What are these? Dogs. But they're not going to actually have dogs, are they? I don't know. Um, they'll be deployed first. Alright, let's just get on with this. The odds are not in our favour, but good enough that a manually resolved battle on a field like this should be fine. If I could decide to send the navy down south and then these guys bloody attack. Now, if we hadn't put the army in the other place, I don't know. We really need to develop up this port. It's a good thing I didn't destroy the, uh, the guardhouse as well. If I didn't destroy the guardhouse, or if I did destroy the guardhouse, we might not be able to win here. So then, what are we doing? Where's the general? All the oh, bloody hell, why does he keep doing that? Okay, they've got javelin men on the side there, but that's okay, don't worry about them too much. That ship's faster. You lock it in place, and you just wait until they're spent, and then you, you go in there, because I don't necessarily need you to die. Everyone else? What do we do? Do we hold that by a, um, by a tower? Or what? Yeah, hold out by this tower here. Try and protect it from these guys. They'll land and they'll get shot by other towers and stuff. That'll be fine. Okay. Just protect this as best we can against the cavalry. Don't worry about using your javelins. You shouldn't need to against weak cavalry like this. Just Keep these guys protected. You, come stand out here, uh, up here, no, over here, and just wait. Right, everything's up to you. You go and lock him in combat. And you prepare. Wait for these guys to leave the area before you go and attack. Make sure that they regret the day they voyaged from their homes, let alone the day they insolently set foot here. They haven't set foot here yet, bitch. And this guy never will. But what I really hope is that he doesn't break before we kill him. Although, essentially, him running away has the same effect as, his di as him dying. Now, these dogs, are they on the ship, or is it just... No, they don't. Okay, good. I don't think so, anyway. I don't see any dogs there. So they're fighting there. Let them be wasted before we use him. They're trying to sandwich us. It's not going to work in their favour. Now you two get out of Testudo now. I think you attack much better when not in Testudo. But it's good to stop their charge. Increases their entity mass. Okay, looks like he's not going to win that. We'll send in him now. Our men flee the field of battle. They're not going to beat this guy. This is a shameful display. We are number him now as well. And these are... What are these units anyway? Heavy the Marines as opposed to... Defeat. Light Marines. What's the difference in stats? Well, these guys are better fighters, so... I reckon we'll kick their ass. Where, where the fuck are they going? Watch where you're going. You're going to... We'll jump off the fucking side there. Oh, fuck idiots, buddy Super Mario dickwits. Show them steel. Look how many of our guys didn't get back on the oh, fucking idiots. Get some speed from them. At least we're winning. They're killing very quickly, which is good. Make sure you kill that general. about chasing them down. Good. The enemy general is dead. And you burned it down as well. That's great. How about you get back on the boat before you all die? Or are you already back on the boat? Good. Back. 
Okay, that's all good. Alright, well, we've, we've won the battle. And it's all thanks to this guy here. And yet, my guys are still dying. Maybe there were some of my guys on the ship. That's okay. The morale's actually very low on that one. That's okay. He's done what he needed to do. Actually, you really need to not run away. If you run away, it's going to negatively affect us. I mean, it's supposed to be a tier 2 unit. Hold steady. Uh, it could be that the other ship running away is impacting them negatively. Shit. Well, do what we can. Don't you fucking break. I suppose maybe once some of these units have died, um... He'll feel a little bit better about how things are going. So these will shoot. Those warhounds aren't going to stand a chance. Good to kill all of them. So they all should be. Yeah, they're all wavering anyway. Crap, our guys are not in a good formation here. Hurry up and get into a good formation. You just hang back here. Get into Testudo. So these are uh, Fundatories or Scottish, whatever the, the fuck they are. So they totally fucking get nowhere. It's okay, it's just one. How are you holding up? Still got full morale. That's not much, but it should be enough. What are you doing? Warlock. Understood. At speed. Are these tier two hurlers or what? I don't know. Stand ready. Defend the test to Well, they're not breaking through this, so that's good. I could send my cavalry over there, but I want to run down these guys. And the tower over here, that's good. I don't think they're going to utilize it though. If we lose that, that could be a problem for him. I don't know about that. Go kill that. His morale is not good. Look, come as far into the center as possible. That way, if you do run, at least we buy a little bit more time. Dying, that's good. I can't believe he'd be wavering at just bloody half of his units lost. That's poor, actually. It's, yeah, it's not even half of his units lost, it's wavering. It's a casualty sustained. You're a fucking coward. You'll level up after this, and um, you'll be a better commander from then on. Okay, you. Uh, don't worry about using your javelins, it's okay. Might get my cavalry over there, I think they're going to be needed. Look at that, they're shooting their own units. This is hilarious. They're so stupid. Look how many of their own units they shot. What a bunch of idiots. Of course, now they're, they're tearing apart my, my guys, but they're still shooting their own units. So dumb. Just let them do our work for me. For us, whatever. How's your morale now? Still minus four, even though that's been captured. So are they. So, how about we send you? Don't use your javelins, just go out there and fight them. Cavalry, come out here. I want you to run down these guys here. I don't want to have to fight them again. 
it might be best if we don't completely destroy this army. That way they have to go all the way back home. Rather than just recruit a new army. Although it doesn't really matter. I'm getting plenty of kills. Nowhere near as fast as I would like. They've got nothing on the old legions of Rome. Absolutely nothing on it. You should be feeling better about the battle now. We're winning. Get back. Get back and get into Testudo. them good now yeah. how about them just do yeah, here they go shooting their own men again a bunch of idiots doesn't concern me oh they are so dumb this game seriously needs a patch It's all right. They've done what they need to do. Just sit there and take it like a bitch. Where's the men are broken and running them. for their lives? That's okay. That's only one unit down. Once they run out of ammunition, what else are they going to do? I'm surprised they're actually doing that much damage. Ah, oh, it's because it's actually because of their other units, right? The men have thrown down their weapons and are fleeing. They won't break through our last little line of defense here. No way. They don't have enough ammunition. Or men for that matter. I think a mass rat will happen soon. Yep, that's fine. Take out this Germanic levy. He's having a fun time. He hasn't lost anyone. Oh, they're shooting them. Try and get him out of there. They don't have a good missile block chance. Into loose formation then, if they're going to do that. I wasn't worried. Okay, well, you might as well come out here and try and run them down as well. They're too slow, don't worry about them. Actually, they should be tight, so maybe give that a shot anyway. No one's likely to come here and attack us again for a while, so it's okay if they take a little bit of damage from the towers. Make sure these guys don't come back. I can't believe they'd travel for literally years, probably like three years, traveling all this way just to be defeated at Syracuse against the garrison. Just because they couldn't be bothered to land on, just go to the land first. If they'd come by land first, they might have won. Escaping, not much I can do about that. Kind of go in the oh, they disappeared. All right, we're done here. <sighs> okay, well, at least we've thwarted that. Yeah, I definitely think that an upgrade of the port here is required. It would have made me a lot less nervous if, nervous if I had a few more ships taken down that this general here. Alright, so... I don't think we're going to be under attack anytime soon, plus the other navy will be coming back, so I think we could justify ransoming them off. Make a bit of money out of them. Anyway, we're going to have to do some repairs on Syracuse because of them.
So they're not actually interested in attacking. They're going to go elsewhere. Birds are making noise. What can I do about it? Looks like the Geppers have two stacks in the area. Damn it. I really don't want the Eastern Empire to fall. Because once they're gone, I'm next to deal with whatever problems. They're probably dealing with more problems than I am. But I suppose it is harder for them because they have to, um... They don't have buffer states now that, that I've created with those uh, rebels. Where are they going? They're coming on a suicide mission. What the fuck? They don't stand a chance. Our guys will be tired, but that won't matter. Just burn them down. And even if it's a rainy day, we still be able to burn them down. There's no way they stay the chance. The auto-resolve is broken. Clearly doesn't rank these guys very highly, even though they're... These guys took out, like, a... Not these ones in particular, but these units took out... Some very good units. You have to stay well out of this. That's a dry day, so that doesn't help them. Well, let's do this. These guys don't even have... Well, they do have javelin capabilities, but they're not going to get too far. Okay. You guys need to be not f rowing in reverse. I don't like that. Come on, shoot him and then move back. There we go, move back. Don't let him shoot at us. The problem is that this is a fleet, so they're not going to be quite as slow as those transport ships. But still, they're not going to be as fast as my ships. Close. You got too close there, I reckon you get shot. Yep, I was right. You're an idiot. Even if we do here, it's not going to help them. It doesn't gain them any ground. They're out of ammunition now, so we can actually stay pretty close to them and it'll be fine. Get boarded. How much does it take to burn these fucking ships down? on this. It's okay, it's burning. Speed it up if you can. Oh shit. They're gonna get wrecked. That's gone. Good. We need you to shoot this guy here. Okay, he's used up all his ammunition. He's useless to the enemy now. The men are wavering. Oh, come on. It's not even that bad, you wanker. I want to replenish, but they'll catch up to us. We need to get further up ahead. I mean, 
we've started smoking, but that's not going to get it fired up just yet. Plus, over time, it does become less heated. Alright, once you start replenishing. You've got the most uh, men left anyway. Okay, another 20 seconds and you're dead. back here. Okay, three, two, one. Okay, good. The men have received more ammo. Okay, now I need you to replenish. Looks like they're chasing this guy now. Okay, how long does it take to burn these bastards down? See the sail is like all fucked. The ship has replenished its ammunition. Good, come on. Might have been easier if we just used heavy shot. Might have actually just killed them all. Doesn't matter, just keep on at it. Can't be much more. That guy needs to replenish now. I don't think he needs to though. We should have enough ammunition, because look how this thing's bloody smoking like crazy. Catch you, they'll kill you if they catch you. What's it gonna take? Are they dowsing it or something? There we go. Oh shit, they're about to catch us. Bloody hell, burnt it down just in time. And they're screwed. They're all dead. Good. They lost everything there, so that whole navy should sink. Technically, we didn't get many kills. Good. They're gone. So they've just got one force left. It's a, an actual land-based army. They may occupy a settlement or something. If I can catch them, I'll kill them. Otherwise, they'll just starve. What's this? They must have hired a whole bunch of mercenaries. Shit. Well, they'll occupy this. If they win. That's a problem. They've got a lot... They fucking hired a heap load of mercenaries. That's so annoying. We have to kill that general somehow. Fuck. At least we know that if they, they're just going to occupy it, they won't sack this. So a lot of the units are already wrecked. We probably... There's actually not that many of them. We probably could hold up at the town square. But this is going to be a close one, but I'm pretty confident of victory. Let's see here. They've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 units. Let's not count them. Uh, just pretend like these are full units instead. So it's more like 10 anyway. Plus they've got to deal with towers. And if we're lucky, we can finish off Africa like this. Alright, so what are we doing? So it's up quite high here, but that high ground is not going to help us. What's going to save us is... Um, the towers. That's where the general is. Now we have to decide whether or not we want to try and kill the general early, or just let the towers do all the damage. I'm going to go with tower damage. Because I think we can handle it. So I'm going to position you... No, I can't do that. Just come stand over here, everyone. And you can move it. Over here. Barricades. Yeah, build a barricade there. Just to uh, keep them occupied. You can move it here. 
It's a good thing it's a dry day. I have every intention of making them pay for their insolence. And when we are done, we will toast our there. success with the wine from their camp. Quick march! Okay, we'll likely have to deal with their cavalry first. They've got three they towers out here that should do some damage to them as well. The enemy outnumbers us. Yes, they outnumber us, but it's not by a huge margin. They've also got a lot of cavalry. Cavalry doesn't really work that well in these kind of battles. So we've got five units versus their ten, basically. It's actually, yeah, it's more than that, but you know what I mean. Add number basically two to one. Mercenary camel warriors, and I wouldn't, don't think we have to worry too much about them. They're coming out for my cavalry. We should be able to avoid them. Shit. Our guys wouldn't bloody completely scatter at the sight of them. If you get caught by camels, I am going to fucking crucify every last one of you. Oh my god, one of my guys got caught. I got no, he hasn't, not yet. That's it, shoot those mercenary Germanic pikes. They'll be a pain in the ass. It's probably the, the unit that I want dead the most. No. Nope. Um, what are they doing? Come back over here. You know what? I reckon you shoot a couple of javelins into them, and they're gone. Come on, charge into them. There's only ten of them there. You can do it. Eight. Is nothing but ash now. Right. I know it's camels, but you should be able to handle them. Plus, they should be pretty tired. Oh crap. Wasn't even Testudo there. That's okay, didn't lose much. That tower destroyed bloody that whole battalion of um, pikemen. Almost. They're not going to be much of a threat. I don't think anyone's going to come from an attack from this angle. Stop shooting. A few kills, you got a few. Come over here. Actually, let's stay, stay there for now. We'll see. We got rid of their camels, that's good. These guys are running around like idiots. They don't know what to do. Yeah, oh yeah, good. Good job. Shoot into the test studio. The enemy is attacking the barricades! They need to rest. I think the battle's going fairly well so far. We'll take a bit of damage here though. What's going on? I'm getting shot. Pull back. Useless idiots. Oh, well, they've used up all their ammo now, they're no threat. Could send them to go fight them, but to be honest, they'd probably beat me. I'm not raiding the settlement, that's good. Romans tend not to do that very often. Come over here. Hide behind here, because these these are uh, Germanic hurlers. They're going to cause some damage to the Legio. Well, actually, they're going to shoot at you, and I don't want you guys in the way. down at them. It's a very poorly placed tower. Should be just a little bit over here so you can shoot down this alleyway. Legio! How the fuck are our guys getting shot? We should be in Testudo. Oh wait. The okay. Yep, you get, you charge in there whilst the Fundatories or whatever they're shooting. That's great. I really need you to go kill those guys, but they're protected. Got the unit shattered, that's good. Just hold that as long as you can. You're up next. 
to get behind him. Try and rally him as much as you can. Has he got any kills? Not really. 38's not much. It's all about these towers anyway. Just try and hold that as long as you can. I don't mind if they keep shooting now because they're going to shoot into their own men. That's nothing. See, they're shooting their own guys here. So it's actually, they're working for me now, sort of. Enemy units have returned to the battle. They're killing more of their own men than mine. And they can't afford to do that. probably won't last much longer. They're already wavering. They're only at half strength and they're wavering. I'll keep it up. They're almost out of ammunition. And then the archers over here. Ah, wankers. Hopefully they don't completely shatter. Come back here and have a rest. Okay, now we're relying very heavily on you. Okay, their slingers probably aren't going to do any more damage. They nearly finished. I hope they come back. Okay, you might actually be... Okay, we can't go down there yet. They're protected by those Germanic warband. Okay, they came back. Have a bit of a rest. Germanic brigands here. You should be able to fight and kill them. Just, just come into here. We'll see. They're not going to do much now. They're trying to come to melee. So yeah, it's all up to, I suppose, these guys holding out as long as they can. And, oh, God damn it! I don't want them using it. That's better than nothing. Well, yeah. Look, if you're going to do it, you might as well, might as well use up your, uh, your darts. Okay, we're free now to come in here and kill them. Although they're probably killing more of their own men. It's still best to just get rid of them anyway. And these as well. Ah, shit! Sorry they wouldn't shoot me, but they did. Okay, get in there. They should be broken. They can come back over here. And you guys as well. Without any missile units, you're safe behind them. Just hold that as long as you can. What's their morale compared to everyone else? Morale 45. Yeah, so they'll last a lot longer than everyone else. What are you doing? I gave you an order to... Fucking idiot. This isn't the battle for you to be an idiot. Doesn't, doesn't matter. Looks like we're uh, okay. We're not going to completely destroy them, but it's going to be a good long while before we can get any more mercenaries. Plus, they'll continue to starve. Enemy units have been rallied. Some of their cavalry are going to get away. Okay, I want you to finish off these these archers though. Every last one of them need to die. Actually, no, that's enough. That'll break the battalion. Fast, good enough. Okay, um, I could have you ram into the back there. Just be patient. They're about to fall. All you guys attack. Alright, charge into the back. Fuck, every time I do that, they turn around. That's okay, then they get fucked. Alright. Because you're going to run all these guys down. Our 
men are breaking up. Don't you break on me. Come on, we're gonna finish all these fuckers off. Now it's pretty much just their general we have to worry about. Okay, infantry units, you come back over here and wait. Let the cavalry get them out of the fucking line of their shot there. Yeah, get rid of those pikes over there. Our men have rallied. Our men are one wavering. of those, one of those, that's nothing. Come over here. He has to come and fight us. The men are running. He's of absolutely no use to us now. Yeah, make sure you catch them, don't let them get away. The men are running. Oh God, that's okay, we don't need them. We've still we still outnumber this guy, and he's he's still eager, so that's a problem. Plus we've also got some cavalry. I think I'll need to use the cavalry to try and lure him down over here. Then again, he's only got 107, you've got more than that, but you wouldn't be able to meet them man for man, you might. Probably won't. Okay, just come over here, take a quick break, and then I want you to try and lure him over here so we can get shot by the tower. Looks like we won this, but only just. Ask Mucky. Over here. No, he doesn't doesn't seem to want to. He thinks he owns the place. He does not. Maybe once I've got control over this, um, he'll start chasing us. Maybe not. Maybe he just wants to hold on to this. He thinks it's the fucking the wind zone. Alright, we're gonna have to out outmaneuver him. You're not allowed this. Don't get into a fight with him. Don't let him have it though. We need that extra morale. And essentially, if we manage to sandwich him with infantry on one side and Smack him with, in the rear with cavalry. If we even get a good charge on him, that'll even the odds. Or we could just wait till the timer runs out, but that'll continue, that'll give it, make it a draw. We can't have that. Um, your charge bonus is shit. All right, what are we gonna do here? I don't know if this works. Oh, shoot, these guys are not great fighters. I think that charge did something. I couldn't really get a good angle on them. We outnumbered them pretty... Okay, yeah. We're fine. We're good. That was close, though. Don't let them get away. Away. Every last one of them needs to die. No mercy. This is one long intern. Just keep getting attacked. They'll likely not be a threat to me again. No more mercenaries in the area now. It's kind of annoying. I might have been able to, able to use them, but I probably would never have needed them. Ah, oh, he's actually dead. So that's the end of this faction. And hopefully we never see it again. It can only arrive in, arrive in Africa. Okay, so... We'll ransom off because I don't expect Palmer to come under attack. It's safe.
Good, we've got a decent amount of money. Got the food under control again. Okay, yep. Faction destroyed Africa. Good. Political obstruction. Use your own influence. Peace negotiated. That could be bad. Raiding, who's doing this? That's no big deal. It's not... Yeah, whatever. Who's this? Flavius... Didn't you already have that, though? Maybe he lost it and then regained it. Why do you still have this? After all the attacks you've done, and that. It's really annoying. Nothing but it makes a difference. Okay, doesn't don't think there's any new enemies. Nope, that's good. So we just managed to wipe one off the map. Okay, this guy's level 3, and he's... Level 2. Alright, we could send him over there to finish that off. At your command. Have that and that. We hunger well, let's just battle. see, firstly. Um, there's no real need to sink them because they're better, they've got to go back home, go. but home is such a long distance that... Whatever. Let's put them raising your army. Oh, shit. Fuck, close victory. I was a bit concerned about that. Uh, take the ransom. He the does not much money. Still and we get another level up for that navy. If we ever need to recall it, because I'm going to disband it. Hey, money goes up. At your command. Let's see here. Integrity? Yeah, definitely grab that. Okay, if we ever need you again, we'll call you. Because these guys are yes. going home. By force march. Or double timing it, or whatever you want to call it. Okay, public order here is under control. Uh, what are we going to do here? The thing is, he is providing public order for the region. So he does kind of need to stay here. Because if we have another rebellion, it'll be Africa. Not uh, just stock standard rebels. Plus, we need to think about perhaps finishing them off, and we're going to need artillery for that. We should actually be able to pick up some artillery in this territory. Anyway, don't worry about it right now. Let's I just sort the public order out here, fix up any problems. There's. Adramentum has problems. We're going to. Yeah. We're going to need to. Um... In fact, we could probably destroy this now. I can't imagine it going to come under attack again and build that fountain yeah I think that would be the wise thing to do the uh, the Garamantians are so far away and you're here now to defend it but we, that we don't need that battle. extra garrison so it saved us in a couple of battles but whatever it can go now our income's at 8,000 that's great I haven't seen it that high before not in this campaign I mean of course I've seen it in other campaigns uh, let's see. So there was this Geet Force fleet that's coming down this way. I don't know, wherever it decides to go, it's going to fail, I think. It might be coming to Brigantium. Because um, it's not that well defended. It seems like it's a long way for a, a very small chance of success. I don't know what we can do about that. Uh, do we have any of these guys... Need to move? No, no, that's all, all good. And you? Yep, it's all good. Just give them a whole variety of abilities. Public order there is more than stabilizing. In fact, we don't even need him here now. It should have plus four if we li if we take him out of there. How are we going with um, paganism? How fast is it growing? Growing very quickly. It's great to see. At the moment, the public order problem from it is just minus two. Not a big deal. Okay, so we've got seven and a half thousand to spend. Let's see, where are the Huns? The Huns are still out here, probably. Are you at war with the Markaman? Markaman, yeah, Markamans. Uh, let's see. I don't think they are. They're at war with factions we don't know about. Burgundians, Ostrogoths, Langobards. I'm glad they're at war with the Langobards. Go finish them off. They're not at war with the Markamans, though. 
Maybe they're just gaining some strength before they move up further north or come back down south. Who knows? Okay, the Gepids are around here again. They can't make it to Syracuse. They might come to Tarentum. I'd rather not fight it. Fight them, so... We'll stay here. If you want to come over here, you'll know you're going to lose. Syracuse is a bit fucked. Okay, what regions here are not making enough food? Okay, everything's producing food. That's why we've got a huge surplus. It also increases lots of growth. Okay, so what else do we have to do? Call it some money. We need to reinvest it. Okay, we've got 44 food here. That'll give us 54 once that's removed. But then again, once we build the thing on top of it, public order's pretty good. We can we can build that for more food. That'll allow us to develop more, more of this kind of stuff as well. Could also perhaps start building these up. Uh, we don't really need to worry about that. It gives us two extra units, but... It's kind of like having an extra guard tower. Now, when are these guys going to disappear? They just don't ever disappear. It's fucking annoying as hell. Alright, what's our richest territory? Narbonesis. Okay, what's this providing? Providing public order and food. Oh, that's expensive though, to go up. Only cause of squalor. How much surplus of squalor do we have? Not much. That there will be a, um, a fountain. This here, I think we should destroy that and build a farm. Because we don't have much food here. We don't need that extra wealth. It's best we have this region just under control. That being said, we could instead go fishing jetties to get the food. I guess. Um, this region's not under any threat. What do you need? Grab some abilities. Yeah, murder. Sounds good. Okay, Liguria. Our, old, our capital. Uh, let's see here. Let's build wealth from all buildings. We get some population surplus next turn, but it's not enough to actually develop it any further. Segustio. I, Segustio. I don't think it really needs that, but leave it there for now. You never know who's going to come across the Alps. Actually... There's no way. They'd have to come around all this way. They'd never make it. We don't need the public order here for that. Especially if we develop that. So you build that, you destroy that. Genua, I don't think needs it either. But leave it for now, because the public order here is only borderline okay. We've got massive religious differences here. Is that because... Yeah, there's still a lot of Christianity here, but it's going down rapidly. So it's not going down as much as I thought. A lot of local traditions. That's a pain. Um, well, we need to develop that to plus five. That'll help. Also give a lot of money. Can't afford it though right now. That's okay. We'll leave that be. What else? Ravenna could also use that. Now we're almost out of money. Oh my got a bit smashed. How's it going for food? It's still okay. That stuff will repair on its own. I don't see anything that I... Oh, hang on. Here's something that, that I need to do. I need to build a... Um, a... Uh, what's the bloody called? A fountain. Because this is a... Uh, got sanitation problems. Oh, well, we'll get to it. Okay, uh, can't do it this turn. How's all this going over here? Imperium's growing slowly, that's fine. Anyone need a position? What's wrong with you? Why do you have bad, bad thought, uh, influence? Um, okay, so why isn't he gaining influence? No, we don't want that. He's not winning any battles, that's why. Doesn't matter. Here you go, you can have that. And you, you're moving, so you can't do that. Hang on, 
cool is this? We do need to build something there, but um, it can wait, I suppose. Actually, if we go back to go back to here, cancel that because that's worth three thousand, and that only that only increases the wealth there by five percent. Where this is actually three hundred wealth of culture, so that's more than five percent, and that leaves us with a bit more money as well. Okay, Malika does not require the garrison here. But it's not harming it, so just leave it be. What can I develop? Could build that up. That'll provide an extra 400 wealth from industry, which doesn't really excite me very much. Crap. Uh, let's see. Uh, food. Do we need more food? No, not really. So the Balnay, Balnay, provides five sanitation to all regions and five hundred wealth from culture. We don't need this. We're better off building a farm. Not yet, though. Oh, what about what about this? Public order here is under control. Let me just see here. Religious differences are the biggest problems. That won't cause that much problems. Okay. How's the food here? Yeah. Okay. Go with it. Okay. That leaves us out of money. Okay, let's just check to make sure no one's likely to attack us anywhere, except for those. I haven't got time to do another battle today, but I'm pretty sure if I press enter, no one's going to attack me. Alright, let's move on. Don't tell me they're going to try and occupy Ireland. Because I'll come back there and destroy it. Don't you fucking worry about that. Nope, they want to go somewhere else. No peace treaties. Although I would technically prefer it. But no. Come on, Eastern Empire. Push back, you've bloody lost Thessalonica to the Ostrogoths. Once I develop all my regions, I'll actually be able to gain more territories as well. And that'll just stop new factions from settling down anyway, because I can't maintain. It, that was the problem with the, um, the Hun campaign, trying to track everyone down. Once we've actually owned the settlement, they can't just come and resettle, they have to take it for themselves. Making hordes easier to hunt down. We do not give I'd like to accept that, but I can't, so it's not the campaign for it. I was right, no one attacked me. Okay, we've got population surplus in... Yeah, income's increasing again, that's great. This is the... Okay, we've got um, Hadramentum, that been destroyed. Where are they going? I don't know, it doesn't matter. Boy, that's replenishing very slowly. It doesn't really matter, I don't want them fighting. The only reason that guy took damage is because of, um, auto resolve. Any new factions? Nope. Demolition complete in Liguria. Healthy. For this person. Yeah, whatever. I am a shadow. But everything just is going nicely. How what are the Huns up to? They're still just staying exactly where they are. They're probably recruiting. So the Sassanids, they're ranked 2 now. And they seem to be getting stronger. Admires Western Romans. That's 
interesting. Even though they hate me. How's the Eastern Empire holding up? They keep falling apart. Oh my god, they've lost all of all of this area here. That's all completely lost. They've only got what? One, two, three, four, five, six territories left. Where's this, how many settlements they've got? No, it doesn't. Oh, well, yeah, it does, right there. Um, and these guys now have 10. Right. Well, I think the Eastern Empire is not going to last much longer, at which point we'll probably have to recruit more units. But we can probably afford three new stacks with that kind of money. But we should, at, at least for the time being, keep investing it so we can push this number up even higher. That way, when the, the shitstorm, I suppose the second wave shitstorm does happen, we'll be even more ready. Anyway, that's the end of this episode, so like and subscribe. Part 47 is next. And don't forget to visit me on Facebook. See you next time, fuckers.